Hello, welcome to Dee Dee's Dolly Den, and this is Denise. And today we're going to address Christopher. Um, I want to talk about Christopher. I got him from Etsy. So he came to me from China. So he is a copycat. I'm going to put that out there right now. But when I got him, I didn't like his body because he couldn't set up correctly. He couldn't uh, bend his legs very well, even though I, you know, I had loosened them to make them bend. Nothing was working. So I went ahead and ordered a body from McPherson's and I ordered the jointed body. And I'm telling you what, it's made a world of difference. You all look at this. He is setting on his own. He is setting on his own. He is now the same height and size as Anastasia. All I did was get the body and I took his arms and legs off the old body and I took all of the stuffing out of the old body and his weighted um, glass beads and I just popped them into this body. That's all I did. I didn't have to add no stuffing, no nothing. It filled it up. See, I like them nice and full. <clears throat> so he is nice and stuffed. He's stuffed really good because that's how I like my babies. The only difference with the body is this one is white because I couldn't get the, um, the, the, the colored body, but that's okay. We don't, you know, that doesn't bother me. He's got clothes on anyway. You're not going to see it. So anyway, I wanted to tell you that because it was exciting for me to get, you know, him to be able to set up like a toddler would set up on the floor so now I can set him down on the floor with some toys in front of him and, and we're good. And he can, I uh, can carry him on my hip, which is how I carry Anastasia. So he's more enjoyable for me now. And yes, it was the best thing I could have done for my little guy here. So we're going to dress Christopher today. I'm going to go ahead and take this off and then I'm going to show you what I'm going to put him in. Um, he got this new Winnie the Pooh outfit, which I showed you guys, I think. No, I didn't show you guys. It's adorable. I got it for $11 on clearance at Walmart. And not my Walmart. We had to go out of town to get it. And then he got these, these shoes. I picked them up at the Goodwill. And they're Baby Gap shoes. And I thought, oh, those would go so cute with his Pooh outfit today. And then we don't have very many socks, so I got these, but you're not going to be able to see the socks when he gets his boots on. So we're going to get him dressed, but I wanted to share about his body because I'm just thrilled because I love, love, love his body now. He's so much easier to move and dress and all of it. I mean, you know, I was just struggling with the way he was built. I was, you know, I still loved him. Don't get me wrong, but I wanted him to be more like Anastasia as a toddler should be. So, um, when they made him, they're just using too small of bodies to be honest. So, um, I think they all, all toddlers should have the jointed, the jointed limbs for that reason, but we have it now and I'm very happy. So, I'm going to dress him today into this beautiful little outfit. I am a big Pooh Bear fan. I've always loved Winnie the Pooh. So if I ever find things that I can afford in Winnie the Pooh, yes, I'm going to pick it up. I also have decided that I'm going to sell my Nicholas. I have a woman here in this town that really wants to get him, and she's going to turn him into a her. So she's uh, going to get with me hopefully today or tomorrow. Excuse me, I had to get a drink of coffee. About purchasing him from me, and that money will be used to go towards my new doll I want to order. Who is she's like fifty some dollars, so you know I can I could pitch in the other ten, but I really want this doll because she looked like me as a child. Um oh yeah, and his body didn't make a difference in his clothes size. He still fits twelve months really good. And some 18 months, depending on how they're made. Um, but most of his clothes are 12 months. But I love his chubby belly now. 
um, I just like chubby babies. I just, I think a round belly makes them look real. So I stuffed him to the max. A lot of people don't like them that stuffed. I do. I like mine stuffed because I want them to feel like a chubby little normal toddler. I'll go ahead and put a socks on first and then I'll do his pants. It's just going to make it easier when I go to put his little boots on. Oh, these are a size three, which is what he wears. I did already try them on and they fit. So his little foot went right in. So I was very happy about that. But he does wear the same size of shoes as my Anastasia. They are the same doll, actually. They're just one's a boy, one's a girl. So, um, yeah. But I love my I love my Liam sculpts, as you can tell. And no, they're not twins. Everybody asked me if I made them twins. I did not make them twins. They are siblings, but not twins. I didn't want twins. I've never wanted twins. So we just make them separate brother and sister. So, um, yes. And I always say that Anastasia's two months older than, or one month. Is it one month or two months? One month older than this one because she came in July. No, it'd be two months because he came in early September. So, I always joke that, you know, their birthdays are different. They can't be born on the same day. So, um, yeah. So, that's how I did that. I guess I should have. Oh, these don't have buttons. It's just elastic. Okay. I was just checking because there is buttons on the side, but they're just for decorative look. This baby is so sweet, you guys. I just love, love, love him. I love all my babies. And why I'm getting rid of Nicholas is, and it's not because I don't love him. He's just not my type of baby. He's just not. I don't, I don't hardly touch him because I don't like babies. Now he's going to, sorry, I moved his legs inward so I could change him. Now he's not going to set up. But, um, I don't like sleeping babies. I just don't. I like my babies with eyes open to me because I can interact better with a baby with their eyes open than I can with them closed. So with that said, I just, I haven't bonded with him as well as the rest because, you know, they've got their little eyes open and I can talk to them and they're, it looks like they're looking at me and, and things like that. So I do like my babies with their with their little eyeballs open. It's just me. I will do some stuff to his hair because it needs to be done. But he is now in his poo set. And it's so cute on him, guys. I just got to get his shoes. We'll get his shoes on him. And then we'll see what he looks like. But um, I went out this morning. I wasn't going to go anywhere. My son called me and said, get ready. And I said, for what? Excuse me, I get drink. My wife is picking you up and taking you to get your hair cut. Now, how nice was that? So I went with her and it didn't need cut cut. It just, it needed a trim. I, I wear my hair in a bob, but I got a trim and I like it. I needed it badly. So I did get it done. This got to be loosened up, dude. Here we go. These shoes are so cute. They're just so cute. And here I tried, pre-tried them on, y'all, and I'm struggling to get one on. What's the deal here, sir? Okay, let's go ahead and get that one's on finally. Let's get this one on. But, um... I've been dying to put this outfit since I bought it, but I wanted to do it on camera. And after I did redid his body, I thought, perfect, we're going to do it today. So here we are. And I absolutely love this kid. He's just, he's amazing. Let me pull the back of this because his foot's in there. It's just not all the way down yet. 
Okay, we got it. He is so precious. He's still an ornery, rough, and tough boy, like I say. And I named him Christopher because I just thought he looked like one. And I've always liked the name Christopher. So that's where he got his name. And then John is after, it's actually after my favorite cousin. His name was John. But I spelt it differently. So it's J-O-N instead of J-O-H-N. But I love the name I chose for this little guy. He is very special to me, and I'm, I squealed when I got him because it took so long to get him. Um, the seller had some PayPal issues. It wasn't, it wasn't her fault, and I stuck with her because everybody was giving her terrible, terrible um, reviews, and she was telling them what was happening. She, she talked to me the whole time about it, guys. She didn't dodge me or anything you know she was very honest told me the problems okay Christopher you gotta try to sit up here baby and um you know she was honest with me about it so honesty is all I asked for and you know I knew she and she was showing me where she was having problems with PayPal but she did get it fixed it took a long time but she got it fixed and she sent my baby right out to me. And I got the tracking and I followed it. And he actually came earlier than was supposed to. So I was tickled about that. I was mad at my postman though because he laid him on the ground by my mailbox. And had my mom not looked out the window and seen that there was something delivered. It could have got stolen. Because I have a bunch of teenagers that walk home from school and they will... They're little kleptos. They will pick up anything and everything you leave outside. So, um, I ran out and got him because I was like, I don't want these kids getting him, you know? Um, cause they don't know what's in the box. They just take the box cause they think there's something good in it. So, um, I ran out and grabbed it, but, and I'm very happy with him. I love him so, so much. He's so cute. And these curls just, they kill me guys. They just, they kill me. I can't believe he's got all these sweet little curls. This is just water I'm putting on his hair. Sometimes I do put a conditioner, but I want to go get some of that baby detangler condition because I think it would be better for his hair. But what I'm using, I mean, it's not bad either because I use it on Anastasia quite a bit when I'm styling her hair. But, and I kind of like the bangs to kind of come over a little like this and then over like this. Yeah, there we go. My handsome boy. Say hi. Say hi, Christopher. But here he is with his little boots. Isn't he cute? I love this outfit. We'll probably be wearing this a lot this winter. They are corduroy. And they're like a... I couldn't explain the color, but they're like a gold color. They're very pretty. And the shirt is gray with little brown. Winnie the Pooh's to match the brown on the front. But for 11 bucks and it's Pooh Bear, I was picking that up. My daughter was with me and she said, Mom, if you want to get that for Christopher, I'll get it for you for Christopher. So she did and I was very grateful of that. And that's the day we also found all the Halloween costume or all the Halloween outfits. So all the babies will be dressed for Halloween, but my two tiny ones because I couldn't find anything for them. So anyway, I want you all to have a lovely, beautiful Saturday. It is very nice here today. It got down to like 31 and it was some frost this morning. Um, we did turn the heat on. But other than that, you know, it's a beautiful day. It's warmed up outside, so it's very nice. But I want you to have a very lovely weekend. And if you guys want to join my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And hit the bell button so you don't miss any of my videos. Um, I would sure be happy for you to, to join. And I thank you all that do watch me. And I'm very blessed that you've become my friends. So with that said, have a great weekend. Live life to the fullest. Because tomorrow is never promised. Bye.